The Nigeria Immigration Service says it will go after the killers of two of its personnel in Sokoto State. Abubakar Imam reports that officers were killed by gunmen at Mamansuka in Godaba local government area two weeks ago. Four other officers sustained gunshot injuries and are currently receiving treatment at Usman Danfodo University Teaching Hospital, Sokoto. The report. The officers were at their duty post along the Ilela Road during the attack. The attackers were said to have came in large number on motorcycles penultimate Sunday evening. Each motorcycle was said to be carrying three men armed with AK-47 rifles. Two of the personnel died on the spot while four others sustained gunshot injuries. Blood stains and smashed glasses can be seen at the scene of the incident during our visit on Wednesday. The acting controller general of immigration Caroline Adepoju, who was at the scene on Wednesday, described the attack as barbaric and inhuman. She therefore vowed to go after the attackers. Two of my men were murdered in cold blood a few days before our anniversary. I would have been on ground much earlier than this, but because of the activities of the 68th anniversary, we lost young sons promising lives. I will not fold my hands. I'm going to move the powers to support me in Nigeria Immigration Service. I'm going to work in collaboration with the army, with the police, and every force. And we are going to go after the people who disturb the peace of Nigeria. We are going to fight them. We are going to pull them down. And we will succeed by the grace of God. Adepoju also visited the four officers that were injured during the attack at Usman Amfode University Teaching Hospital. While consoling them, she commended their bravery and promised to take care of their medical expenses. During a courtesy call on Governor Ahmed Aliyu, the acting CG sought for the state government support in the area of logistics. From Lela Border Post, Abu Bakar Awal Imam reporting for Trust TV.